Salome Zarabichvili is a French Georgian politician and former diplomat who currently serves as the fifth president of Georgia in office since December 2018. She is the first woman to be elected as Georgia's president, a position she will occupy for a term of six years. As a result of constitutional changes coming into effect in 2024, Zarabichvili is expected to be Georgia's last popularly elected president. All future heads of state are to be elected indirectly by a parliamentary college of electors. Zarabichvili was born in Paris into a family of Georgian immigrants. She joined the French diplomatic service in the 1970s and went on to occupy a variety of senior diplomatic positions for three decades. From 2003 to 2004, she served as the ambassador of France to Georgia. In 2004, by mutual agreement between France and Georgia, she accepted Georgian nationality and became the foreign minister of Georgia. During her tenure at the Georgian Ministry of Foreign Affairs, she negotiated a treaty that led to the withdrawal of Russian forces from the undisputed parts of the Georgian mainland. She has also served at the UN Security Council's Iran Sanctions Committee as the coordinator of the Panel of Experts. After a falling out with Georgia's then-president Mikhail Saakashvili, in 2006 Zarabichvili founded the Way of Georgia Political Party, which she led until 2010. Ultimately, she was elected to the Georgian parliament in 2016 as an independent. She vacated her parliamentary seat after being sworn in as president. During the 2018 Georgian presidential election, Zarabichvili ran as an independent candidate and was supported by the governing Georgian Dream Party. She prevailed in a runoff vote against Grigal Vashadze. Zarabichvili was born in Paris into a family of Georgian political emigrants. Her father, Levin, and began a master's program at Columbia University in New York in the academic year of 1972-1973, taking courses with Zbigniew Brzezinski. Zarabichvili is a cousin of Ellen Carre Dinkos a distinguished Franco-Georgian historian who serves as the head of the Académie Française. Zara Bichvili abandoned her studies and joined the French Foreign Service in 1974, becoming a career diplomat with postings to Rome, the United Nations, Brussels, Washington, etc. The first time Zara Bichvili visited Georgia was in 1986 during a break from her job at the French Embassy in Washington. Salome Zarabichvili was head of the Division of International and Strategic Issues of National Defense General Secretariat of France in 2001-2003. She was appointed the Ambassador of France to Georgia in 2003. President Mikhail Sarkishvili of Georgia nominated her as Minister of Foreign Affairs in his new government. Zara Bichvili became the first woman to be appointed to this post in Georgia on 18 March 2004. Zara Bichvili was the coordinator of the panel of experts assisting the UN Security Council's Iran Sanctions Committee. As Foreign Minister of Georgia, Zara Bichvili was the main negotiator of the agreement for the withdrawal of Russian military bases from the territory of Georgia, which was signed with Russian Minister of Foreign Affairs Sergei Lavrov on 19 May 2005. During her tenure as Foreign Minister, the new group of Friends of Georgia was created, bringing together Ukraine, Lithuania, Latvia, Estonia, Romania, Bulgaria, the Czech Republic and Poland to help Georgia's aspirations towards NATO and foster European integration. Zara Bichvili was sacked by Prime Minister Zurab Nogaideli late on 19 October 2005 after a series of disputes with members of parliament. She had also been heavily criticized by a number of Georgian ambassadors. Shortly before her dismissal was announced, Zara Bichvili resigned from the French Foreign Service, which had continued to pay her a salary while she was minister and announced that she would remain in Georgia to go into politics. In November 2005, Zara Bichvili set up the organization, Salome Zara Bichvili's Movement. In January 2006 she announced the establishment of a new political party Georgia's Way, criticizing the country's de facto one-party system. Although Zara Bichvili enjoyed some degree 
of reputation in Georgia she was long unable to establish herself in the political field. At the city council elections in Tbilisi on 5 October 2006, only 2.77% of the constituency voted for her party. Six months before, an opinion poll conducted by the Georgian weekly queries Palitra suggested that she would garner 23.1% of the votes at presidential elections. Since October 2007, her party was part of the United Opposition Alliance which nominated Zarabichvili as a prospective prime minister in case of their candidate Levan Gachechladze's victory in the January 2008 presidential election. As part of a 2009 campaign of the Georgian opposition to force President Mikhail Saakashvili to resign, Zarabichvili led a protest march together with three other prominent opposition figs.